The masts are up and the boats are in the water for Georgetown's 24th annual wooden boat show. The show benefits the South Carolina Maritime Museum, the only building along a section of historic Front Street to survive last month's tragic fire. At that time, five of the buildings were pretty much destroyed. It was working on the sixth one and headed to the seventh one, and the museum was the next one. Johnny Weaver helped organize the boat show. He says he'll never forget that day in late September when the fire broke out, displacing nearly 10 families and leaving 130 people out of work. Weaver says he watched from across the street as firefighters fought to save the building and everything inside from the flames. By the time it got here, there were several fire departments here. They had hoses trained on this our, our building and the one next to it trying to save this. And they did, with the museum sustaining only minimal smoke and water damage. It's been less than a month since that tragic day, and Front Street is already buzzing again. Exhibits and boats lined up, people everywhere. To come back with this rubble back here behind us, with all of this devastation, to have an event like this where we are literally bringing down thousands of people down downtown Georgetown to let people know that the rest of the shops are open, Georgetown is still alive and well and, and a thriving place. Thriving like the Maritime Museum still standing above the ashes, a symbol of the strength of all those affected by the fire. In Georgetown, Mark Liverman, WPDE News Channel 15.